if you <laughs> if you're on social media, you must have seen by now. I might have. I'm not dying. People were talking. People are telling me, "Oh, we're gonna miss you." Okay. If you're just um, you live under a rock and you're coming up for air for the first time, you know by now. I am leaving the show. I've decided to leave the trend. And next week, Friday, will be my final show. It's been a really great run. I started doing this show back in December 2012, and I've been blessed to just really have some of the greatest people come on and speak to me um, from all over the world. We've done the show in different places. We've met such great people, and you and I have had such an experience with this. And I want to say thank you to all of those who've watched this show and who've uh, made it worthwhile. This has been, like I always say, the best gig on television. And you know what? I thought about it today, and I was like, if you look at Friday night television in Kenya now, everybody's trying to do what I've done. Yes, I said it. Everybody's trying to do what Larry Mito has done. They're copying the trend. Everybody on every channel. I think I can't compete with my students anymore. People are trying to be me, so it's time for me to move on. That's a simple reason. Um, it's good to be able to leave something, especially something that you love, and go on to do something else. And for me, I'm just grateful that I had this chance to be a part of something that's great. I've worked with the best team on television. They are young, talented guys, and it's been a privilege and an honor to present their work because truly, these guys that you never, you've never met, they are a credit to this profession. They are truly the best that you could ever find in this business. And that is why the work that we do here is copied by everyone else. I've said this before. Kenyan TV's idea of innovation is monkey see, monkey do. We do something successful, everybody else tries to do it. So I'm done trying to give people ideas. I'm going to try and maybe an, on a different night of television, maybe do something else and so other people can copy it. But two is also, um, if you watch this show, you notice that I've been away a lot. I'm traveling more and more now and I, I felt that I've not, I wasn't giving the show 100%. So it was time to step away so somebody else could have that chance, right? I think that's great. And whoever it is who's going to take over the show, I, I can assure you they're going to be great. They will be tremendous. It's true. It's unbelievable. Uh, so I'm really excited about that new phase of the show coming on starting in the, in the next month after I leave. I think it's going to be really great. And the other thing is, it's been problematic for me. The people that watch this show, most of you are really young. And you didn't realize this, I've been doing this show for four and a half years. But I just didn't do the trend, even though a lot of people thought I, all I did and do for NTV is the trend. In the time since I started doing the show... I went and completed my degree. I learned a new language. I did more than 150 international trips. I ran a digital team. I did the news. I write a column. I speak at lots of um, tech and digital media events around the world. All of those things happened on top of the trend. And so sometimes it's good to be able to focus on some things and drop others. So that's the simple reason why. And I'll speak more about this in the week, in the week ahead and next week when we do my final show. We'll have a lot more to discuss on that. But right now, I just wanted to say really thank you. It's been the greatest ride of my life. I used to be a business reporter for five years. A lot of you don't even know this. I did business news for five years. And when I came back from CNBC Africa, sitting in Johannesburg, and I wanted to come back home, the trend was not part of the deal. I came back to do the news, and the trend became available, and I did it. And for four and a half years, I've done this thing, which has meant so much to me and has meant so much to a lot of you who have told me that. So I really appreciate all the great comments and the love I've seen on social media today. That's really nice. It's good to, see, to get some love for a change. Okay, I'm